Jekal. This story is from the Panchatantra. Once there was a Jekal in a forest by the name of Mohan. One day, Mohan, driven by hunger, went to a nearby village in search of food. He was extremely hungry. Unfortunately, he met a group of dogs and they started chasing him. The jackal got frightened and fled in panic. He entered a washerman's house in a hurry. While trying to hide himself, the jackal slipped and fell into a tub full of blue color, which the washerman had kept ready to dye the clothes. Soon, the bark of the dogs ceased and Jekal came out of the tub. There was a big mirror fixed on the wall of the house. Jekal saw himself in the mirror and was surprised to see his blue colored body. He came out of the house and quickly ran back to the forest. When Mohan reached the forest, every animal failed to recognize this new creature. In fact, they got frightened and ran in all directions. Taking advantage of the situation, the Jikal planned to keep the situation in his favor. He asked, Why are you running like this? There is no need to panic. I am a unique creation of God. He told me that the animals in this jungle had no ruler and he had nominated me as your king. He had named me as Kakur and told me to rule the forest. Therefore, all of you can live safely under the cover of my protection. The innocent animals believed the shrewd jackal and accepted him as the king. The jackal appointed the lion as his minister, the tiger as his chamberlain and the wolf as the gatekeeper. After allotting positions to the animals, the new king Khakur banished all the jackals in the forest for the fear of being recognized. Now, the animals hunt food and brought it to the self-proclaimed king. After taking his share, the king would distribute the remaining food equally among his subjects. So like this, he was leading a luxurious life. One day, when the blue jackal was holding his coat, a herd of jackals were passing by, howling to their glory. Suddenly, Blue Jekal forgot that he was a king and not an ordinary Jekal anymore. Unable to control his natural instinct, Kakur howled at the top of his voice. Soon, the animals realized that they had been fooled by a Jekal. In a fit of anger, all the animals at once pounced on the blue Jekal and killed him. Moral of the story, the one who abandons one's own folk will perish.